Yo, I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the fame Though it might be nice to own a jet plane I'ma do it all for you, come along and see it's true But the world is pretty cold, you might need a sweater too Yo, what's up guys, it's Like and Line and I am with your second upload of the day. That's right, there is a double upload today. If you would like to check out the first video, go to my channel. The link will be the second video, <laughs> obviously. So, today, we're going to be talking about the Frost Spawn Traps. I already talked about the Frontier Spawn Traps. Now, Frost, it's kind of interesting. There's one decent Spawn Trap. This isn't the best really Spawn Trap map. It's more you have to know the alleys and know when to peek in between each. Whereas Frontier, you could aim down and just know where they're coming. This plays a little different. So the middle of the map is just, it's all out warfare. Don't even try to hit clips in the middle of the map. There's a big machine on one side and a wall run where it's just not going to go well. The other left side, there's a little alley. But unless you're playing something like Defender, there's not really going to be many clips there. Now, there are two sides where you're spawning in the back. They'll spawn on the side too, like I said, in that alley, but the main spawns are in the back. We're gonna go with the worst one first. As you're gonna look here, it's a black alley. Down that alley to the left, there is a door. As you can see, this man is running out of the door. Their spawn is right back in that back left corner. If you look up at the radar, you can see how it curves. That leads back to their spawn. That would be the first way to look. You can run up to that door and then look in and snipe or sit here, they'll rush you if there's a lot of them coming and you can pick them off there. Then in this next picture, it's to the left of that if you look on the radar as they line up, but to the left is a ice kind of tunnel. And this ice tunnel, they'll either have to run through a back door, which if they're back there, there's not really much you can do as you're only getting one third of the opportunity for when they spawn, usually don't clips usually clips don't happen there and why I didn't put it in this video but if you look right here you can see an alley going down now if they're not coming down that black hallway with the door on the left side look down this alley and usually two or three people will come down there depending on their spawning may only see one but that's just how it works the one thing people have been picking up on recently or if you're in this spawn trap I don't have a picture of it but if you've been watching trick shots there is an outside wall run around that wall that's the only real way they can get around it unless taking that back corridor, which really leads them into kind of a boring zone. Well, it's not really boring. It's just not very good for clips. So if you were playing Cypress, they're obviously going to run down these two alleys. Now, for the next part, this is the better spawn trap. You're going to see three different alleys. Uh, the first one will show you the far left first. This is the outside. There's a little wall run in the back. You can kind of see besides that person's body. Down there, there's one or two head glitches and people will spawn there and run out. That's where you're probably gonna see the biggest clumps. You will see people coming out and then you can snipe them there. Once they start dying out there, there's a little wall behind it. And in the way back, as you see in this picture, that is where they can all come through the center. This is where Kitty hit his five on screen time too. It's a great spot. I would definitely recommend it. You look straight down this alley. Make sure not to stare at these three spots. I would recommend backing up maybe to mid, making sure you clear out the side so they're all pushed back into that spawn and then push forward again. But if you look down there, there will usually be a cluster of them, especially on Domination. On Domination, there's a spawn or a flag right there. You can clip them all off of that. The next one is to the right, as you see in this picture. There's a little alley there that leads back to that big ship I was talking about. To the left is another door. You will either look down that door or look down this alley, and you can see people coming out of that alley. And when they come there, they're easy pickings. They're ready for you to go. The only thing I would be wary of is if they slide fast enough, it's hard to get shots on them. They can slide past that door and then come back and kill you, which makes it rather difficult to kill them, obviously, if they're sliding by. And then you don't know whether they're going to run back or not. And then you have to worry about the other two corridors, which is the one hard part. Your only barrier, there's this wall. It says 3C Research. That wall is your only barricade, and it's really thin. It can barely hold your whole body behind it. So that would be the only thing I would worry about. Otherwise, those are the three spots from this side. You keep intervaling in between them. Hopefully they spawn for you. If they're not spawning, back up, make sure to clear them out of the middle and then push up again. Same for the other side, clear them out of the middle and then push up again. If you can get some friends to stay on the left side and make sure they're only pushing to the right, that would be the best way to do it. Again, do not rush the spawns. Does not work well, especially when this game, it's mostly team deathmatch because domination is all sweats right now. 
But I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. Hope it helps you guys out once the beta comes out again. I'm super excited. I'm actually recording this on Monday. So it's the last night of the beta and I'm kind of sad and I need to get back to playing. But I just did hit a quad feed. Hey, you know, your boy's hitting clips. So, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. Thank you all so much for watching. Make sure to check out my links in the description below. My Twitch, where I will not be streaming the second weekend, except for Sunday night, possibly, because I will be at my dad's house, but I do stream there. And also my Twitter, etc., in the description, so you can keep updated with what's going on. Thank you all so much for watching. Please remember to like, subscribe, and YouTube. We'll see you later. Okay, it started with a dream. That dream turned to a vision. That vision had a gleam. That gleam is now realistic. My friends are beefing now. Like, why you acting distant? I swore all you love is music and ain't got no time to kick it.